Welcome back everybody to the channel. So today we're back with Euro Truck Simulator, episode 3. So today is going to be a little bit different. So um, I, I kind of just wanted to uh, take a different approach for this one. It's going to be a little bit longer, but I'm just going to, after this intro, guys, I'm going to show you guys a montage of all the jobs that I've done, just because if we would have gotten the truck by one episode, one job, right, one job per episode, it would take like 20 episodes just to get to the truck. So I just thought... Uh, I do some stuff behind the scenes, you know, record all of it, and then put a montage of all the stuff on after, right at the start of the video, and then I'd show you guys, um, my final trip before I get, before I get the truck, and then I will show you guys how I took off the loan from the bank, just to try and get, uh, just to get a truck for crying out loud. So, uh, I hope you guys enjoy, um, thank you so very much for watching this, and, um, consider subscribing, it's free, you can always unsubscribe if you change your mind. Thank you so much, have a great rest of your day. And I, uh, I hope you liked the uh, montage. That was my first attempt at a montage. I was, it was a little short. Uh, the ending was a little rocky. But um, if you guys have any suggestions on how I should close that off in the future, let me know. Um, so before we get into anything else, I, I left one stone unturned, uh, and that is um, the how much a truck costs. So let's go to the truck dealer and just show you guys how much one costs. The, like the very first truck, it's like something like 99 euros. No, not no, no, not online. Okay, is there? There, yes. So we're we traveled there, and this is the very first truck, like 99,965 euros. That's insane. That's like 30 runs. So that's why I went ahead and did all this stuff behind my behind the scenes. Um, so. You're probably wondering, my money's at 26000 and I did so many runs, right? Well, I actually messed up on one or two, and I got a $12,000 fee that I had to make up. So, I, I I put in like nine hours over the past two days, so I'm sorry for the late update. But I was just trying to get to the truck. So, uh, let's just show you guys how much I improved, I guess, with a job. And then I'm going to show you guys how to take out loans and uh, so forth. Uh, so... For this one, though, I'm not exactly going to be uh, using the truck as soon as I get it. I'm going to save that for the next episode. Um, and, uh, yeah, I guess let's just let's go to the... Let's do this job. Um, right. 
So, since you do get skills at the... Once you level up, I decided to go with the category of um, important cargo or uh, high value important... Yeah, important cargo, I think that's what it was. And it gives you more money f if you take those sort of jobs. So, it's, it's been a little bit easier, I guess. But, I mean, I, you guys don't know how frustrated I was uh, just after I completely capsized over a mountain or something like that, cliffside, and I barrel rolled all the way down, ended up having to get towed, and it ruined everything. I, I had to pay s a really large amount of money, and I, I was mad. I was very mad. I was, I was furious. I was, I, I couldn't, I can't tell you guys. I was so burnt out yesterday, trying to record and do everything. I I just gave up. So what you can ex when you uh, you can expect the next episode to be uh, I'd say mid next week because um, I'm probably gonna take a break from this game for just a little bit just for the fact that I just spent so much time on this game. Kind of want to take a break. That'd be kind of nice. Um, but I'll get back maybe Tuesday or Wednesday. And if I get bored, I can post as early as Monday. But, um, thank you guys for being so patient for this one. This one just took hours and hours to do. Like, nine hours total within three days. Uh, two days. So, while you, while I was doing the stuff behind the scenes in those, uh, trips, I actually found, I found a couple of cool features of the game. Like, uh, going across the English Channel, you actually went onto a boat. Uh, sorry, not a boat, a train. And it was really cool because you got to park yourself right in the in like a section of it. It was it was really cool. And uh, and then I also was uh, the police. I, I saw what else the police could do. Like uh, there was an accident between car to car, and they actually brought down a helicopter uh, for some apparent reason and blocked off the entire road. I kind of just skipped past the cones, so hopefully I didn't hurt anybody. Um, but uh, it's it's interesting. It's very interesting. So another thing I wanted to point into is that I also got a short message or something like that about um, hiring other drivers to work for me and do jobs like that. So I have to figure that out at some point because that would have been nice to know like before I went through all this trouble. I mean, I could have had people working for me and stuff like that. So I mean, it was a little annoying, but we got through it. We worked through it. Ugh. So, some future ideas for videos include, um, well, first me, uh, getting better trucks right, um, and everything, but I think another thing that I'll try and do is try and learn how to do the classic, um, point of view steering, like this version right here. I, I don't really like it much, but it'd be, it'd make for a good video and show you guys what exactly it's like. So this is, this is not fun. I don't, I'm not a big fan at all on this mode, but I, I'd do it for just to show you guys what it's like. Because <clears throat> I've seen a lot of people use that way, and I'm sure it's a lot better for you, but whatever. Uh, another thing that I would like to touch on too is also um, how the different weights and cargo that you get can affect you, uh, your driving style. So like if you were to um, have like a super um, heavy um, load like a uh, 23 ton load cargo or whatever um, it would actually really uh, benefit you to go slow on a lot of turns and stuff like that otherwise you'll just barrel roll you'll um, you'll end up getting a lot of airtime and it's, it's not fun having to tow yourself all the way back to the services and it and which ends up losing some money based off a of time penalty and stuff so the lighter you are, the better you are at maneuvering, so just um, know that if you have heavy loads, just take it slow. That's all I can tell you guys. Like right here, this is a generally good area to show you guys that you have to like slow down on these turns or else it's, you just go crazy out of the way. and It's, it's, it's tough going slow, I know that for sure because I've been there, but it's like, it's so much easier just to slow down, not worry about it. Because otherwise you'll end up paying for it. 
Otherwise, there, there's not much else to add, not much else to this game. I mean, it's it, it just takes practice, and like I said, I don't know if you can do better based off of your um, point of view, uh, camera angle, and uh, but I'm I'm doing just fine with these, uh, just uh, the number two setting for camera angles. But uh, also another thing that I have to tell you guys about is the cabin customization so you can actually so if you click f4 you can actually adjust your light your illumination at the at when you, it gets nighttime or raining because otherwise you get fined and then you can also um um there's some more adjustments that you can make to in, inside the actual cabin itself but it, i thought that was actually really cool that uh, it has it because it's actually very useful to have some light on while uh, driving at night. So this game, for being eight years old, looks absolutely incredible. I mean, it's if you just think about it, it is great looking. You guys gonna go or should I? I'm gonna go. But it's it looks great. I mean, it's um I was on a bridge. Um I was during the rain during nighttime. It was great. You know, it's it's definitely not not much compared to anything nowadays but it, it, for eight years ago this was pretty stellar I do have to say I mean you can you can tell how old it is but just just how it looks you can tell how much time people actually put into this game you know and it was it was it was very well done just very well done in general I mean like look at this it's 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 Definitely not rendered. It looks like it's not rendered all the way, but for eight year old game, wow. And that this was great. I feel like 2015 was really the pivotal point when games started to look phenomenal. You know, like uh, 2015 Battlefront. Uh, that was a great game. I loved playing that. I don't think probably not as good as the first one, as the first original Battlefront. But Battlefront 2 2015 was probably one of my all-time favorite games. Played hours upon hours of that game, and it just looked great. So I, I bet that's about when games started to look absolutely incredible. Another thing to be paying attention to in this game is uh, what country you're in, because certain countries have different different driving um, areas of expertise. Like this, uh, like I think I'm in somewhere somewhere other than London, right? Uh, you the UK. And I don't have, um, it's like a different speed limit. It's 37 instead of 30, 40, 50, 60. Um, you don't really get a signal for when, you don't get a sign for when there is uh, speed cameras up ahead. So it's it's really different, actually, when it comes to down to the place that you're go driving through. So, I mean, yeah, what you going to do? And that, another thing, too. So look at this. It's incredible. It's a literal railroad. It's that's incredible. I that's something. It, it just amazes me. It does. This just came up to me since uh, we're passing a parking area right now. Uh, if if you're new to the game and you haven't tried it out yet, um, do not rest unless it's absolutely needed, because it takes up so much time. If you rest for maybe. Um, if you rest for like the lowest bit of bar, you will have to wait six hours to wake up. Well, that's not the t type of time you have on these short distance um, trips. So, just fair warning if you're new to the game and you haven't tried it that yet. Oh, it's starting to rain. It's starting to rain. So here's a good point. So, um, in if there's a police officer that goes by and sees that you don't have your headlights on during the rain, you will get fined. So, go to four. F4, then you click 2 for a low beam, and you have your uh, headlights on so that you won't get fined. Oh, yes, we're coming up to a bridge. I think my favorite thing is being on a bridge. It's just because it looks so cool. So freaking cool. I mean, look at that. The water, um, ships, right? I actually saw a... Um, cruise ship actually one time crossing one of these bridges they're just so cool i mean i love in real life um i really like uh just driving over bridges in general because they're just so cool looking 
course, not the rickety old ones, right? Just the new ones. They're so cool. We will be reaching our destination in just a couple of minutes, so please buckle up and th and enjoy the rest of your ride. Thank you for choosing Plush Roadways. <laughs> uh, love that. I love doing that because uh, the flight attendants usually do that right when you're coming to a close. It's great. Maybe I'll do that now at the out end of every single trip, you know? <laughs> Uh, I think I'm so I'm st I think I'm so funny when I'm not. Uh, but we are approaching here, and I'm very excited because we will be buying the truck right here. It will be taking out some loans, and we will be getting the truck. I'm very very excited. Oh my gosh. See, yeah, dude, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. Oh. In the next episode, too, I will explore all the um, options that come with the truck, uh, getting a truck, right? Your first truck. Like, uh, when it comes to truck upgrades and stuff like that, oh, it'll be so cool. Definitely the next chapter in the series. Yeah! I'm so sorry. Nobody saw that, nobody saw that, so I think we're good. When you can, please try and avoid going past red lights, because they are expensive. I mean, expensive. You can actually go through uh, using yellow light, but going through red light, that is expensive. So just try and avoid it if you can, if you get what I mean. It's expensive. It's like 280, and then if a police officer is present, it's like 480. It's insane. Insane fine. Another episode that I'll have to do is showing me mastering this, um, backing up anywhere they want it, because I absolutely stink at that, so I, hope, I promise I'll master it at some point. Good work. There's some good moolah. 6,411. 6, I think we've got it. Oh, yes. And we got skill. Skill point. So now I can show you guys all of the stuff that I have. Um, I think I want to go with... The high value... Cargo is just absolutely insane once you get it higher, so I think I'm just gonna try and max that out first. So, alright, so here we go. We got $30,000, we're gonna have to take out two $10,000 loans and then one $50,000 loan. To be able to pay for it, it'll be expensive, but we'll get that truck. Alright, yeah, you got it ready? My first loan. Yeah. Ugh, that's, that's, it's just, ooh, what are they? Alright, ready? And a big one. The big. Hey! We got it. We got enough now. 101 is my balance. So let's go ahead and let's let's get that truck. Let's get that truck. I'm excited. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh my god. It's, it's taken so much time just to get to this point in time. Very excited. I can't believe it. Oh, shaking. Ooh. Is there a way to... Oh, my gosh. There it is. There it is. It's gonna be my truck. Let's get it. Let's get it. Here we go. Bang. <laughs> That's awesome. So, what does that mean? What does that do for me? There we go. The cutscene of the century here. Oh, it's beautiful. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. I've spent nine hours at least within two days. So this is absolutely mind-blowing that I actually got to this point within this time. So happy. Alright, well, let's drive it into our home. To our headquarters. Oh, the steering's nice. Steering's nice. Oh, it's beautiful. 
absolutely incredible.